this great initiative of uh, bringing youth of Afghanistan and Pakistan together. Uh, this uh, idea actually took fairly, uh, I would say, a long time to, come to uh, get into this shape because we were planning this event and then I must uh, uh, congratulate uh, the Youth Forum team. They actually, uh, I would say, very immaculately uh, did uh, this event and uh, I, I think they need, a, they, they should be a clap for them. So uh, I'm also, uh, I also want to congratulate Pakistan's external media wing and uh, we had the honor of having Pakistan's ambassador in Kabul here who actually uh, was very helpful in shaping this uh, event. And I'm also, uh, I would also like to thank the participants uh, in this seminar uh, all the distinguished uh, journalists from Pakistan, the people who work on Afghanistan, they came together and contributed uh, in this event. Most of uh, the policy, I would say, uh, the young delegates from Afghanistan were very candid in asking questions to Excellency, the Prime Minister of Pakistan. And just uh, you know, a few hours back, they also met uh, Army Chief and got the, his point of view as well. So Pakistani leadership is very clear about Afghanistan. We want peace in Afghanistan because the greater idea of Pakistan's future economy revolves around a stable Afghanistan. What, what the idea is, we really want to open up to Central Asia. We want a very strong communication linkage with, linkage with, with, with the Central Asia. And for that purpose, when uh, His uh, Excellency Prime Minister visited Uzbekistan, we have already signed a railway track agreement with Uzbekistan that will actually go from Peshawar to Mazar Sharif and then to Tashkent. Likewise, we are very keen for our TRRT uh, uh, agreement that allows trucks to pass through Afghanistan and to Central Asia without actually changing vehicle. So, and likewise, we want to provide access to Gawadar and Karachi ports to Central Asia, and for that purpose, the primary focus of Pakistani leadership is that to have a stable Afghanistan. Because only a stable Afghanistan guarantees that uh, frequency of communication between Central Asia and uh, this region. So uh, the, the, the whole, uh, I would say, I, I, the, the, the youth of Afghanistan, the journalists from Afghanistan, uh, they asked, asked, they asked all the possible questions uh, from the Prime Minister and as uh, many of you would have uh, seen, uh, it was the program was aired today early in the morning and also we had released it with the Pashto and the Dari titles. Uh, I hope uh, that uh, the maximum population of Afghanistan will be able to know the policy of Pakistan government directly from the Prime Minister of Pakistan. Likewise, all the misperceptions about Pakistan, Prime Minister has clarified all those. We are not siding, we are not strengthening any one group in Afghanistan. This is very clear policy of Pakistan towards Afghanistan. We are trying to create an atmosphere. We are trying, trying to create a, 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 a situation where all groups of Afghanistan can come together and form an inclusive government. Because we believe this is the only way through which Afghanistan can actually form a stable government and a peaceful society because we believe that no one group in Afghanistan right now is in a position to capture whole of Afghanistan. So even if one group takes over Kabul momentarily or the other try to stick to Kabul for a longer time, it won't, be, it won't really bring peace. So we are trying whatever we can to bring the, the, the parties which are literally at uh, a war with each other together it was a difficult job. Uh, as uh, I said in, in, in my speech in the forum, that we are prisoners of geography. You know, uh, the superpowers do not need our permission for their action. There were consequences, and both Afghanistan and Pakistan had to go through those consequences. But uh, we are trying to build a solid future for Afghanistan because we believe that the solid economic future of this region lies into a stable and peaceful Afghanistan and all our efforts are directed 
towards that. I hope you had a good time here. Islamabad is a beautiful city of ours, misunderstood at many levels. But uh, inshallah, with these kinds of visits, I am also uh, looking forward that now that uh, this group has been here and uh, have uh, you know seen Islamabad and have met the leadership uh, themselves and they have heard the Pakistan policy directly from the top leadership of Pakistan. Now we will surely arrange a Pakistan senior leader, senior journalists uh, to visit Kabul and see the Kabul themselves, the meet the leadership there, and then come back and primarily Ministry of Information at the Ministry of Information. Prime Minister Imran Khan is very candid about it. He believes that uh, the it's it's actually the awareness of the common people that can actually bring the longer time stability and at the Ministry of Information we believe that media is obviously the only way through which we can actually exchange our point of views at people to people level and this is what we are trying to do thank you very much for being here and I will looking forward to more visits